This is Mitchell from Gamefront, and this is Deus Ex Human Revolution. Something's wrong, Jensen. I pinged you, and a second later I lost your GPL signal. It's like you disappeared into a black hole. Gotta be a jammer. Well, obviously. If you can find the transmitter and take it offline, I'll be able to track you. And keep you on a tighter leash. I've got more important things to do than help you keep tabs on me. If Megan and her team are here, there's no time to waste. Hey guys, welcome back to our Deus Ex Human Revolution walkthrough. We're, uh, we're in the, pretty much the last run of the game, or last leg of the game. Uh, we're in Singapore, this is a research facility that they're holding, uh, Dr. Megan Reed and the other scientists from Seraph. And we're going in a single person rescue mission right now. Let's take this guy out. I'll take that pocket secretary. Thank you very much. And actually, let's read it really fast. Because this is for the dormitory. Alright. Looks like those two guys in the window are busy talking to each other so they shouldn't shouldn't be a threat All right, he's turned around uh, yeah. stupid dumpster That was dumb. <laughs> Why is that guy the one that's Hello? investigating? If hiding here, you'd better come out. <laughs> Shit. Hey, what happened? Go ahead, try to wake him up. I dare ya. I dare you! Oh, come on! Come on! <laughs> oh, that was ridiculous. It's alright. You know what? I wasn't trying to hit him. I was trying to release some inventory space because I have way too many uh, pistol ammunition things. I have way too much pistol ammunition. Alright, so now what we want to do is... I'm not going to take some pistol ammo because I have too many. Remember, that was why I missed him so many times. I'm just trying to release up some some inventory slots. Seriously, guys. I'm not that bad at aiming. Right, let's check this. Alright, we got radar controls. Which is what we need right here. Zero, one, one, one. You must have done something, Jensen. Four of our GPL signals just popped up, including yours. Koss, Colvin, Faraday. I'm not picking up Dr. Reed. Send me the coordinates you do have. And Pritchard, tell Sarif. I can't. While you were incommunicado, Mr. Darrow invited him, Bill Taggart, and the UN delegates to Panchea. They're halfway to the Arctic by now. Great. Alright. I think we have a code for this. One, three, eight, five. Oh, nice. Typhoon ammo. Credit chip. I'm not sure if uh, we need credits anymore, but maybe there's a secret shop somewhere. Because we're done with Hengsha and we're done with Detroit, so. We got a bunch of guards over here. Let's take a look around. I 
that's where I just came from. So we got one, two, two guards on the bottom floor. It's not that bad. It's not that bad at all. I'm gonna take this one out. You didn't see nothing, camera. this guy out. Oh, he didn't even see me. Nice. Oh. Take you out. Maybe he has a maybe he has a key code on him. Yep. As I surmised. Top frag. This guy's apparently a FPS gamer. Let's turn these off. Hack this just in case. Oh uh, no, not gonna be able to. <gasps> oh no. That was close. I don't know what saw me, but that was close. It's a level four hack. I'm not gonna be able to get in there. What's this guy doing? Oh, it's too bad I can't get into that door. I could have uh, used the wall kill on him. Starts. And we have a vent! Ladies and gentlemen, we have a vent. Oh, I hope this leads us to our, uh, our destination. And yes, it does! What's up, girl? Get the hell out! Damn, this lab so mean is to me. off limits to I'm you. Here to people. save you. Nice to see you too, Doctor Goldman. What? Wait a second. I know you. You were Seraph's security guy. Way to protect our asses. Hey, check the attitude, Doc. I nearly died trying to save you. Oh, and now you're here to take me back. Well, maybe I don't want to go. Maybe I've got more here than I ever had at Seraph. Would Vasily Savchenko agree with that? They executed him and dumped his body in a ditch. That's not true! Believe it. Unless these murderers have you so brainwashed, you don't mind building their toys. It wasn't a toy. It... 
It was a software upgrade that limits functionalities in a biochip. They told me it was for crowd control. Is Vasily really dead? You saw the body? What was left of it? Oh my god. I should have listened to him. Dr. Colvin, I need to locate the rest of the team. But Dr. Reed's GPL isn't broadcasting. She's in the secured zone. There are guards everywhere. Then I need a way to get the guards out. A distraction. Maybe a lab accident, what do you say? After what those bastards did to Vasily? Of course. But one minor incident in this lab won't be enough. No. But if a couple of other labs go up, simultaneously... Declan and Eric. Of course. Interesting idea, Mr. Jensen. Ambitious, but risky. The timing will be critical. I'll coordinate the attack. But you understand that this could all backfire. I'm no shrinking violet, Mr. Jensen, but... There may be another issue. They're tracking your GPLs, aren't they? I've been wondering how to get around that. Smart man. Just like Vasily. He had a plan to shut down their tracking and jamming protocols using a virus. Maybe Declan or Eric know something more about it. Why should I trust you? Dr. Colvin, I need to know I can trust you. You seemed pretty happy to be here until I told you about Dr. Sevchenko. It's been six months, Mr. Jensen. Not long for you, perhaps, but how long can a person live in constant fear? Once they took us out of isolation, it just seemed easier to concentrate on the work. Did all of you feel that way? Vasily didn't. Maybe not Declan either, but the work we do here, the discussions, and the theories. I thought Seraph's projects were far-reaching, but the experiments I've seen going on here, it's the kind of stuff DARPA dreams up every day. Only without governmental oversight keeping you in line. I suppose I'm just a typical scientist to you, right, Mr. Jensen? Blindly pushing boundaries? No care for who's footing the bill or how our discoveries get made? We all have to live with ourselves at the end of the day, Dr. Colvin. You're right, of course. But were things so different in Detroit? We all know where those Seraph contracts came from, don't we? You asked me if you could trust me. You can. But you better get on with this. I still don't trust her. She's, uh, she was kind of an asshole to me. I haven't yet located Eric Cost, Dr. Colvin. Do you know where they're keeping him? He's working in a lab on the third floor. There's an elevator that might get you there. It's on the second floor, though, and I heard the guard say something about that floor being shut off. But then again, with those neuro enhancements of yours, you might find a way to get into it. Dr. Faraday doesn't seem to be working in this building. Any idea where he is? I think he's in the biomech lab next door. But you don't have to go outside to reach him. There's a skywalk that connects the two buildings. Maybe you can use it. Okay. Wait for my signal, Dr. Colvin. When your GPL starts to vibrate, set off the distraction. I understand. And I'm sorry for what I said earlier. Thanks for watching our walkthrough for Deus Ex Human Revolution. And please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.